Welcome to Wallach. From heart-pounding near misses to eyebrow-raising decisions, this video will have you on the edge of your seat, questioning what could possibly happen next. Buckle up for curiosity and suspense like never before. Let's start right away. In the event of a stalled vehicle on the tracks, follow emergency procedures, call emergency services, and report the situation promptly. Everyone, raise awareness about the importance of safety at railway crossings, encourage responsible behavior and adherence to traffic laws. A truck missed and drove into the right side of the vehicle. Do not imitate this. Wow, that is so scary. Thankfully, there were no injuries. He is fine. The motorcycle got snagged on a bush about six feet down till they pulled it out. Nobody was hurt. Oh, oh no, I doubt he's got enough insurance for that. I guess 90% fault cross tour, maybe 10% on the McLaren. The front vehicle ought to have turned on hazard lights, and the following car must have also maintained a safe distance. Every time you get behind the wheel, you hold the lives of yourselves, your passengers, and others on the road in your hands. Stay alert, everyone. This is a video caught by the dash cam of Ohio State Highway Patrol Trooper out of routine patrol. This accident does not look like it involved any other vehicles, which is a miracle since it is raining. Fortunately, the driver is all right. Stay safe, folks. This chase happened on December 13th, 2023 at approximately 11.33 p.m. The police performed a tactical vehicle intervention technique. Who is wrong in this case? Let me know your opinion in the comments below. One. Please be careful out there and pay attention when you're driving. Get yourself a dash cam video camera to protect yourself. No, what are they doing? If someone gets caught driving like this, I think it should be an immediate revocation of their license for at least one year. Wow, how lucky are they? Because I had my car totaled this way last November. There's a cop right there. You can't U-turn, man. He narrowly avoided this Corvette turning left in front of him on his drive to work in the morning. His traffic light was green.
god, what the f lady? Oh my god, man. Oh my, I remember that if the driver couldn't find out who dropped it, he would ask the truck for compensation. Let's like and subscribe so that you don't miss any of our next videos, guys. If you enjoy our video, leave a comment below with a number one. So at least good work on braking without locking them up. Do not text or be on the phone when driving. Distractions can lead to delayed reactions to changing traffic signals. Oh dear. Man, adhere to load limits specifically by the vehicle's manufacturer and local regulations. <laughs> yup. Yup. <laughs> you said it too. Literally. Oh. You stop it, okay. Whoa. That truck in about four seconds occupied all four lanes of the road. Oh, wow. That... If you witness this situation, you should stay, call 911, and show the video to cops. At least the driver is safe. This is why avoid overloading your vehicle, as excess weight can put extra strain on tires and increase the risk of blowouts. When you are ignorant of the height of your vehicle, such incidents happen. Be careful, folks. Whoa. This incident proves how powerful mobile phones are. Guys, simply pay attention to the road. Guys, let's regularly inspect the brake pads and shoes for wear. Replace them when signs of significant wear are evident. Glad he didn't involve any other cars. Whoops, he seemed to lock up the front brake without using the rear brake at all. Really? I don't understand why someone can do that. Do not imitate this. Oops! Be particularly cautious during hot weather, folks. High temperatures can increase tire pressure, and overinflated tires are more susceptible to blowouts. Huh? What is he doing? Do not imitate this. Oops, what was wrong with him? Or proceeding through an intersection, practice the fundamental look both ways principle. Check for oncoming traffic from all directions. Man, focus solely on driving, avoid eating, grooming, or engaging in other activities that divide your attention.
If using a GPS, set your destination before you start driving. Be mindful of the center of gravity, especially when negotiating curves. Whoops! Cargo trucks have a higher center of gravity, making them prone to tipping. Oh my, stay in your lane, bro! Well, did someone forget the handbrake? At least there were no collisions with other vehicles. When passing a truck, do so on the left side or whenever possible. Never linger in the truck's blind spot. Oh dear, yield to vehicles with a right of way and avoid making turns that would violate these rules. Do not imitate this. Who is at fault? Let me know your opinions in the comments below. And a bit of skill or luck, the driver managed to regain control. Whoops! Hopefully the driver learns a valuable lesson and this is the end of it. It makes sense to constantly check your mirrors when operating a truck. Check the mirror first, it's crucial for safety, especially while changing lanes, positions, turning left or right. A Florida man leading a Florida Highway Patrol trooper on a high-speed chase on an expressway near Tampa. He was ultimately forced to turn himself into the officer. Man, stay calm and have a patient driving attitude. If you notice erratic driving from nearby cars, be prepared for sudden lane changes or swerving. This is the same as running a red light or a stop sign, six points off your driver's license and a fine if you get caught. I can't believe that they don't step on the brakes in such situations. Hope that drivers drive as cautiously as they can, even though I'm aware that large cargo vehicles find it quite difficult to stop suddenly. The larger vehicle, the more mandatory training on driving and vehicle management and punishment must be provided. Oh my, thankfully there were no injuries. is fine. Who is wrong in this situation? You decide. Oh no, hopefully someone will alert him. Slow down everyone. Seriously, how does rolling coal work? How do you think they make their car do that? I would be furious if my car was damaged in this way. Hope they can work things out nicely. Do not cut across multiple lanes to make a left turn. Such maneuvers can be unpredictable and increase the risk of a collision. Be cautious of vehicles that may run red lights or fail to yield oncoming. 
Luckily, there were no collisions. If you do miss an exit, remain calm. Most highways have alternative routes or opportunities to turn around and correct your course. Do not imitate this. Hey bro, don't cut off the other vehicles when changing lanes. Stay focused on the road and avoid distractions, bro. Be prepared for sudden stops by having your foot hovering over the brake pedal. This is a similar situation. Well, reduce your speed as you approach an intersection. Be cautious of vehicles that may run red lights or fail to yield the right of way. How could you not see that truck? Glad nobody was hurt in this situation. <laughs> Well, bro gave himself a pit maneuver. Glad no innocent people were hurt. Oh my, that is so scary. Fortunately, no one was injured. Although it appears that the Hyundai has entered the lane, I believe that truck drivers should check their blind spots. No way! Seems the SUV was stolen. Everyone is okay. Attempt not to run a red light, dude. Patience and patience. No way. Van driver tried to cut this car off? Don't do that, bro. Ugh, it must have been the work of a rookie truck driver. Be careful, man. Whoops, this means that even with a green light, you still need to be aware of your surroundings. What do it, old boy? Wow. Glad this dash cam owner did send this to the local police so they could use it or send it to the people's insurance. Oh no. Driving pretty fast and doesn't appear to see that the car or even attempt to brake. Look over your shoulder, man. This is the reason why rear view mirrors were invented.
Whoops, in this case, who's going to pay the insurance? It's good that all of them are fine. I know the frustration of biking in the snow. Look how, look how deep this is. Look, look how deep this is. Luckily, he is okay. See, <laughs> so if I was on the KTM now. Love when people help them. Respect. Well done, bro. He tried to avoid the collision until the end. Thank you for watching videos from start to finish. Share your favorite moment in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this video, please show your appreciation by hitting the like button and subscribing to our channel. See you next video.